cover lock it it's very good I like this system right so it's time to pull the wires
guys this is a uh, 48 volt type of heaters and this is uh, usually used in Norway because they have a rule they are only allowed to use 48 volts or 50 volts maximum so, uh, we are making a heaters for them good heaters and this one guys maybe you are uh, wondering what the spring for the spring is uh, is uh, to keep the tails intact while you are heating or you can even even lose one bead you can destroy it and when you have a spring on the spring will always uh, keep on pushing out the beads so they are always intact the, yeah because when you're eating guys the some the part of the tails is expanding so without the springs then you will have a lot of gaps on your tail so with this one it helps a lot many companies not many companies using springs i think it's only one only we are using it <coughs> yeah for me as a technician too to have the spring on the tail is very good because some uh, those who are just uh, producing the heaters they don't know uh, what's the importance of it. Me as a technician, it is really necessary. See guys? See. You can pull it, gap, and then it will come going back. So you can destroy one of it. And uh, yeah, and the spring is still will push the beads all together. Alright guys, this is now the 16 bead heaters that we have been doing for a couple of hours. 16 bead heater. Yeah, that is for today's vlog guys. Thank you for watching and please don't forget to click like and subscribe. Thank you.